Hi, I'm Shanna Gordon-Katz, an associate at the Feldstein Family Law Group. Today I'm going to provide you with some tips and tricks on how to reduce the anxieties and stresses that come with listing, selling, and closing on the matrimonial home after you have separated from your spouse. You may think that coordinating the listing, sale, and closing of the former matrimonial home will be a breeze after you and your former spouse have negotiated and executed a full and final separation agreement. However, a lot of planning and organization is required to keep your stress at bay. The list of things that you have to do to successfully list, sell, and close on the home may seem never ending. For example, you have to hire a real estate agent, retain a real estate lawyer, ensure you have all the necessary permits and documentation in order, notify everyone of your new address, pack up your home with or without the assistance of your former spouse, and move in and set up a new place to call home. While the list may seem overwhelming, here are some ways to stay calm when it's time to move on. Number one, give yourself time and plan ahead. It's easier to do a little bit every day, day than to do everything all at once with a deadline fast approaching. Number two, stay well organized by making a list of all the tasks you need to do, then set reasonable and attainable deadlines, allowing yourself enough time to complete everything on your to-do list. Number three, Clear out the clutter. Getting rid of the clutter will help you be and feel more organized. It will ensure that you, when you begin packing, you will only be packing the things that you need and want to pack. Number four, ask for help. Rely on your friends and family who are your support system. Even if your friends and family have not personally gone through a separation or divorce, most of them have been through at least one move in their lives and understand how hard it can be. Number five, Ask your family law lawyer for his or her recommendations for a real estate lawyer. Number six, work with your former spouse to prepare the home for sale. It's okay to share the costs associated with junk removal, staging, etc. with your former spouse. If you need some help coordinating these details with your ex, your family law lawyer can help you facilitate this conversation. Number seven, engage in self-care strategies. Allow yourself the time to say goodbye, get enough sleep, and eat well. Finally, keep your eye on the prize. Remember that as you move out of your home, you are starting a new, happier chapter of your life. Should you require information about your separation and wish to schedule a consultation, please visit our website at www.separation.ca or contact our office at 855-909-9903.